Thank you. Mm. that we see here in Dallas. You know, you never know who's coming on campus. It's daily, the dress code? Dress Every code day? Is daily. Okay. From 8 to 5, and on Fridays, you can wear jeans. So, <laughs> we have a, a people, we have dignitaries come up here all the time. You know, mm -hmm. last Monday, I hosted an event, and we had, you know, Commissioner Wiley Price, and, you know, all these different, you know, judges and defense attorneys and lawyers. That's the internship I was just talking about. I just got an internship for this summer, Monday, mm -hmm. just from that event. Okay. Being here in the Grand Lounge. Like, people want to help Paul Quinn. People are helping Paul Quinn, especially the black community in Dallas. So, you got to be prepared at any time. You know, somebody walking across campus with prison Square or something, and they just see you and they're like, wow. Because they're not used to us young people dressed up and looking, you know, looking how we look here with Paul Quinn. jump in. That's what they expect. <laughs> so, it's cafeteria. Um, so the cafeteria yeah. opens every day from 11.30 to uh, 1.30 for lunch. We have breakfast every day already, and dinner every day from 4.30 to 6.45. Um, the cafeteria is really renovated. We have, I wish we could go in. But they're closed right now. We have a mural that's like, craziest thing I've ever seen because it was drawn before, it was drawn summer 08. President Barack Obama was sworn into office in November 08. But he's on there, he's on the mural, like the biggest picture on there. So it's just really interesting. Um, the food is great, I'm not even gonna lie. Some days, you know, it might be not the best, but everything is good. Like, We've come a long way in the cafeteria because people complain. Like, it was one year we had straight chicken, like, every day. Chicken nuggets, chicken fries, chicken. <laughs> so it's a great option now. How are you doing, Miss Andrea? Very good. This is Miss Andrea. She's our farm manager. Hello. 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 Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So we have a football field that is now an organic farm. Mm -hmm. um, Miss Andrea, can you tell them a little about the farm? Love to. Is it okay? Huh? Is it alright? You're on camera. Sure. Okay. <laughs> this isn't going to the press. And oh, no. <laughs> this is off, off the record. <laughs> um, okay. So uh, we have a two acre space that we have planted for um, our college. Mm -hmm. We have um, four distribution 
places. Um, the first will be our cafeteria. We're going to display a vegetable or fruit of the month. When we get our orchard this year, we're going to put in some fruit trees. We already have strawberries planted right now as well. Um, we give to the cafeteria, we give to the community because this is a food desert. There is not a place for them to get food. There's no grocery stores in the zip code. Mm -hmm. um, we also sell to chefs mm -hmm. and then we also give to a local charity. Mm -hmm. um, last semester we gave to the Well community who cares for the um, mentally challenged folks in Oak Cliff. Mm -hmm. So right now, um, two acres, I would say a quarter of it is planted right now. So if you have time this afternoon, please come down and be ready to plant. I love volunteers. We have a good time and we work hard, but we also play hard. We have fun activities as well. Um, it is all organic and we do that for the health of our earth and for our bodies and our, our environment. So um, are, are you prospective students? Uh, yes. All right. Well, I would love to see you come down. Oh, I'll probably be down at the farm about 12.30 today if y'all would like to come down there. Okay. And just very quickly, I'd like to introduce my daughter, Ella. Oh, okay. She's with me today. This is Mr. Evans. And um, she's, she's also known as the Dirt Diva. <laughs> she has a good time in the dirt. So, mm -hmm. um, do you have any questions? Mm -hmm. Come and ask me this afternoon. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Okay, so the farm is like our highlight right now. Uh, the farm is pretty much the brand new thing that Paul Plank has set us out amongst not only HBCUs, but many different universities. You know, this spring we're taking a trip to Yale. Um, every year we have a service learning trip with the president. And he picks different students to go. You know, we have like 10 or 11 students this year. And we're taking a trip to Yale and we're going to help them on their farm. Mm -hmm. So that's really, really inspires us to you know, continue to make ours better. Mm -hmm. uh, and also on that trip, you have this different social aspect of it. So we're going to go to New York and go shopping and different things like that. But uh, so the farm, two acres, football field, they're doing. Farm is one of the biggest revenues here at the school. So uh, they have three different grants going on right now. Mm -hmm. One of them is to build another farm. You know, three more acres. Uh, how are you doing, farm? Okay. Three more acres of farmland. So tearing down trees. And it's, they're going to get chickens. They're getting honeybee. She, she only said a little bit. <laughs> they, they're going to have a honeybee class, like honey making class, you know. So I told her I volunteered. I think. <laughs> Are you, you, you gonna be in the honeybee? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so that's like it just sets you know the school apart for different things. I like that. Producing all the honey, like that. All right. So 